Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is uh, barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is uh, a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. This is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. We're underway. Who do you, Jim, see making a difference here? A guy born to be a footballer, Luka Modric, always thinking about his next move due to the fact his, his technical ability is so strong, astute and intelligent. He's, um, he's such a telling passer. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. Messi floats one over. Get a throw in. Just whacks it away. Dembele knocks it away. Dembele with good energy in defence as well. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition. And I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Silva, De Bruyne. He's being closely tested here. Tries to get it forward quickly. Van Dijk. Aimed long and direct. And it's Messi. Conte. On the side, especially adventurous early on. Now the breakaway. Forward it goes. That will be a corner. Can he dig out a shot? Laporte gets good distance on it. Mbappe, it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. De Bruyne plays it out to the flank. Modric. Aimed long and direct, and it's Azar. Azar tried to play it through. Oh, Peter, his body shape was a giveaway before he made the pass, and its obviousness was, was appreciated. Here it comes. De Bruyne. Van Dijk. Keeper's got good distance on that. That's a throw.
Keeper goes long. Going through. Chance. Shot a goal. That's a lovely try, but not to be. Well, there are a few pockets of space that are being exploited, and they need filling, and fast. And it's hoisted clear. Plays it back. Now, surely! De Bruyne. Neither side yet able to find the net. De Bruyne. Conte. Chance to break. Just brushed off the ball there. And it's messy. He's played him through. And the ball's come out. Now it's Azar. Silva. Great strike, but the keeper's equal to it. Stitch defending, but that'll do. Modric. David Silva is demanding it out wide. He'll have a dip! He's delivered all right! An exhibition in how to finish with a minimum of fuss. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Listen, when it comes to goals, Peter, in this team, he's always the number one contender, and he's done it again. Hernandez. Gets himself into trouble and he's lost it. Now it's Messi. He's got away, and the flag has stayed down. Messi. Swept, and the finish! That is wayward. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. Hernandez goes looking. And it's got through. Mbappe has a shot! Goal! They have hauled themselves right back into it. Oh, whose goal is that? Big deflection. That's one for the dubious goals panel.
has certainly made things interesting. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal. It just got caught napping. In Dembele. There's the end of the first half. Genuinely interesting game here. Very, very watchable. Two goals, one each. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Look, this match promised goals, and it certainly hasn't let us down. It's been really, really entertaining. That's a really interesting game, and they head in at half-time at 1-1. And so we're off again. Laporte. Silva. And it's Azar. He's through. Conte, he's left his man, plays it out to the wing. Good delivery, no joy. Well, plenty of moving targets to pick out in the box. Obviously increases your chances of the ball being met like that by someone. Safety. Driving on now, what can they conjure from here? Dembele. A retrieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Gets it back. De Jong. And Dembele. This was gone, that's a foul. There could be trouble here. And now the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. And it's Mbappe. Surely. Silva. Azar. Silva. De Jong. Mbappe. Modric plays it. Yeah, forward. that's tough defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Silva. Now it's Messi. Out to the left it goes. Back into the middle. And he's there to cut it out. A slightly better ball would have led to a very different outcome there. Uh, that was just poor decision making. And has a swing at it. He scored. And the comeback is complete. However, they tried to stand in his way, he just was not to be denied. Well, I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked the scoring position when it didn't see him on. It's really crafty business, that. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. Yeah, they deserve great credit for turning things around, but they'll now need the defensive resilience to equal that attack and flair. There's a long ball. Here it comes. And he certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. Just the talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Just whacks it away. No. 
Now it's Sonny. Silva. It's an end! Can it's bounced out! They've done it! They've done it again! It is incredible! Messi. Julie reaps his reward, kept his cool whilst the defence lost their bearings. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat-trick. So all square and not for the first time. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you're pegged back again. Mbappe has been caught there, it's a foul. Well, that's a booking, always looked it. Keepers to claim. Conte. Oh, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Dembele. In Dembele. Tries to dink it in. He's got the ball, he's got the space. And he heaves it forward. Now the counter. Sane tries to get it forward quickly. Fence has got rid of that. And Dyke sends it forward with interest. Cuts it out. Aimed long and direct. Mbappe spreads it towards the left. Going through. Cleared without complication. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Now it's Hazard. There's no flag. Silva. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Chance to carry finish! And out to safety. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Chip through, shoots! Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. A more than decent attempt, Peter. He's pulled play back and has booked him for the original offence. Time for a change in personnel. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. Now it's Messi. De Jong goes looking. Dembele, Alexander-Arnold, in Dembele. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Rafael Varane. Go 
goes long. And that's been leave it clear. De Jong, who's short. Chills what shakes the shoots. No, poor contact, nothing on the shot. And that's that. So nothing between them after all of that. And you can't really argue with the result. By the manager too unhappy with the outcome. And the fans really well entertained. It's all square in the end. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Well, a decent draw, Peter, with a good mix of action and plenty of talking points. And it ended with the right result, in my opinion. Well, that's it for tonight's match. So it just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin alongside me and to wish you all a very good evening.